Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Superior deck. This is the black version from the Conjuring Arts Research Center. These cards were printed from the Expert Playing Card Company and they are done on their classic finish. These decks were recently released from Conjuring Arts. They did them in brick form, so you could get the red brick, the blue brick, or the black. I chose the black because uh, it was the different one out of all the three. And uh, you might recognize the back design. This has been on a couple of other uh, different decks, including their most recent reader backs. However, these cards are not reader backs. The Superior brand is something that uh, Conjuring Arts wants to have as a new series of cards that will encompass a large range of variations. So in the future you're going to see different finishes, different colors, all with the same back design, maybe a different back design, um, gaff decks, cards, and lots, lots more. This is going to be their staple deck going forward. This latest release, they were solely focused on a classic design and a classic feel. The tuck case is made with a special synthetic paper that will last and last and last. It is actually tear resistant, tear resilient, so it'll help protect your cards um, from moisture. Also, if you like that classic uh, looking tuck case, it was designed by Jackson Robinson. The front of the tuck case says superior brand, fine quality playing cards, classic black. And right across the top, it does say the Expert Playing Card Company. This side says the Expert Playing Card Company. This side says Superior Brand Playing Cards. The bottom has some ad copy, and the back design is, of course, the back design of the cards. Tuck flap is really big, and you get that nice Superior Brand logo again. And that is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. Again, these are printed from the Expert Playing Card Company, and they are done on their classic finish. You know, a lot of people always ask, how do they feel? How do they handle? That's all subjective. What I can do is tell you how thick these cards are. These cards come in at almost a B standard. Okay? They're about as thick as the Honeybee cards um, that Penguin Magic released. Um, they're as thick as the Arcana cards and the Camp cards that Dan and Dave released. The classic finish from Expert Playing Cards is named classic because this deck feels most like what many card handlers are now used to. It's a softer stock but it's easy to handle uh, and this classic stock was developed by Lawrence Sullivan over at Legends Playing Card Company. And really what Conjuring Arts wants from this deck is uh, for this to be your go-to deck for playing cards. Uh, they handle wonderfully. Uh, they are traditionally cut for perfect weave shuffles. Uh, and the cards themselves are thick, so they're very resilient. You got that resilient tuck case as well. And uh, that's why they want to sell you um, the bricks uh, as cheaply as possible, either in blue, black, or red. And you could even get a combo brick if you wanted so that you could have a little bit of everything. The back design is simply a weave of vine work um, that is beautifully balanced between the top and the bottom. And you have a really nice uh, thin border, which makes for great flourishes and great fans. With this deck, you're going to get two jokers. Um, they are the jokers that you see in a lot of the expert decks, including the Zen decks. It is simply a jester standing with his legs crossed, holding a fan of cards. The pips and indice cards look very classic, and they have a nice old, um, like Times New Roman uh, font in the corner. The court cards all have a very old, very classic feel to them. They definitely look like vintage playing cards. Also, your Ace of Spades, again, very familiar to those who collect the expert cards and have the Zen cards. It is simply a mystical face in the center of a large black pip. All right, so that is my review of the Superior Black deck from the Conjuring Arts Research Center. As always, recommend that you like this video just so other people can find it faster. We also recommend that you subscribe to this channel just to stay up to date on the latest in cards and card magic. If you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm at facebook.com slash magic orthodoxy, twitter.com slash magic orthodoxy, instagram.com slash magic underscore orthodoxy. And if you need more content, you can always find it at magic orthodoxy.com. Thanks, bye.